Today we're going to look at one of my favorite tools or tricks in Photoshop. It's using the Defringe tool to smooth out edges on an image that you have copied from one photo to another. What I have done so far is I have taken this good looking guy and I have made a selection around him. You can do this with several different tools. Once you make your selection, you want to soften the edges just a little bit. Oftentimes, if you don't do that, you'll have a very hard edge and maybe a little artifacting around your layer that you're putting into the new photo. So what you can do is you go up into Refine Edge, and then you just feather it out like a pixel or so, and that's really going to help it out. Now that I've softened these edges, I'm going to copy it, Command-C, go over to this photo, and paste it in, Command-V. He's a little too dominant in my shot for my liking, so I will move him down to the corner. I will use my Move tool, V, and drag him down to a point where I think it works out a little bit better. If you look close at his shirt, especially in the dark areas, say here and down here with the rocks, you can see where there is a white line that is a result of shooting him on a white background. The way you get rid of this, you go up to Layer, you go all the way down to Matting, you choose Defringe. And I'm going to use a, a width of one pixel. Sometimes you may want to use two. Most of the times that I have found that one pixel works really well. I'll click OK. And now you can see, if you look at the rocks, this white edge along his shirt, here along the rocks, under the sleeve are gone. I will hit Command Z to bring back that line and now you can see by using Command Z what I have done. Now a lot of times if it's a small image defringing won't matter but if it's a larger image it can really make a difference. I'm waving to you from a lighthouse that I shot in Maine. Hope you enjoyed this quick little trick. More to come.